previously on RL Graph. Yep, there's a wither, like, right up there. Go get him! I'm stuck in the web, guys! Go get him! Dude, I'm so glad I chose to wait until I was stronger to come in here. I, I, I can't s I just fell. I definitely just fell. I can't see a thing! That's such a broken effect! I just realized that if something takes my weapon during this, I'm probably dead. We're breaking all the sp- Oh my god, the spawners. Please stop. Please stop. Come on, man, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? That is what I thought. You're gonna do nothing. Dude, I literally... There's still, like, infinite withers on this screen. I would like to know how many nether stars we got. We got 22. We got 22 nether stars. Slaps roof of my base. You can feed literally no frames per second in this bad boy. What is up everyone? Welcome back to episode 36 of Oilcraft. It has been quite some time since we've done an episode of Oilcraft. Uh, we did have the first episode of One Block Skyblock and we did a charity live stream and we raised $305 for Red Nose Day Project along with the total $4 million raised for the entire event. Um, it's definitely more than that now because the event ends on the 20th and I'm recording this on the 16th so we'll, we'll get like a total number for that but I have done quite a bit on this world in between um I actually wanted to play Oilcraft again which is good and I, I don't know if you notice okay it's not doing it now but my FPS is bad in my world now inside of this like my house the FPS is not great but I do want to show you guys some cool things I did around the uh, around the place so First off, you may be noticing some new things here. Uh, it's disgusting winter right now, which is awful. But I kind of, I kind of like set up these uh, dragon skulls here. See, look at this! Look at this! 35, 33 FPS. I set up these uh, these dragon skulls and some withers with some of these, and I kind of made these like light areas up here. And I do have one finishing touch for this room. Um, I want to put like armor stands along the lines right and then this area in the middle i need to get rid of the torches but if i f7 if i break the torches i need lights in the ground otherwise stuff's gonna spawn in here but otherwise than that i'm very happy with how this turned out oh you you guys broke out again huh that stupid chupacabra it is somewhere down inside one of the caves under my house and i could not find it um so i did enclose this area if you did watch the live stream, I did show that. I'm probably not going to use my Zaffin farm anymore. Oh my god, this is like... This is kind of comical over here, really. God, it's so different than what it used to be. I'm probably not going to use the Zaffin farm anymore. It's uh, it's too much of a risk for a little reward. Look at look at that. Look at all that slime. Too much risk, not enough reward. Um, Not worth it. Uh, I did go out and I was hunting more villagers. Stupid snow. And you know, I've been casually plopping guys in here and leveling them up. And I found... Oh, I found a bunch of new boys. So first off, I put signs on all of them. This one is upgraded potentials and adept one. My looting three guy ended up with viper five. Uh, efficiency five guy, nothing special. Supreme flame. This man ended up with advanced flame. Wait, why did I put supreme? Okay, well, advanced flame, whatever, same thing almost. So we have advanced flame. This boy, I found another upgraded potentials. And this one's cheaper! This one's only 12, and this one is 36. That is a third the price, that is stunks. Does he, have I upgraded him? Yeah, he also has adept one, which is odd that they both have identical enchantments. Makes me think there's a limited amount of villagers out there. And then over here, this guy has advanced fire aspect, which is cool. So advanced fire aspect one. So we can end up getting advanced fire aspect three for our weapon. And he has life steal four or life steal three. That's pretty cool. This guy has subject PE three and advanced luck of the sea. I only kept him because of subject PE. I don't think, and he has infinity. So, I mean, that's cool. I don't 
It's whatever. I have a lot of villager spots. This guy has high jump two. And he ended up with both advanced thorns two and advanced thorns three. Which I don't think I want to put on, but I might. This guy has advanced fire protection three. I don't need that, but I couldn't resist keeping it. Is it such a rare enchantment? I I couldn't I couldn't throw it away. And that's it for the new villagers. Say welcome to our all to all of our new villager friends in ch in the comments. I almost said in the chat. Um, so I've been harvesting lots of sugar cane so that way I can trade with them. Um, this new pro strat that I've kind of been doing. Every single village I find, I just steal all their bookshelves with a non-silk touch pick, and I just get lots of books to trade them for lots of emeralds. So that is pretty stonks. Um, something really big. You probably just saw it there. Is this still winter? Gross. Last night, I worked on my bed area, and I am so proud of this area. It is beautiful. Look at this. This might be the thumbnail. You'll, you'll know by now if it's the thumbnail, but based on what else we're doing in this episode, you'll know. I did say I was going to kill a boss, but I found something. We'll get to that. I found something really interesting that we'll go, we'll go and do. Um, so... Beautiful, beautiful place. Uh, I need another set of red tide gear. Red tide armor. Whatever words, English. And I'm really happy with it. It's so beautiful. And that pig is just... Mwah. Peace of resistance. Um, and then we've got a bed right here, which apparently it's nighttime. And yes, I tried to make the bed level with the wool. I know you can do that in newer versions of Minecraft, but this is poo poo doo doo butter version of Minecraft. So you can't play stuff on like half slabs. So yes, it goes down. Whatever. Sue me. There, uh, there might just be a little secret over here. Since I had a little bit of extra weird space because it is the design that I made for this house, I, um... Let's just say they're matching on both sides, but if I were to rub up against this painting, you know nothing. But, like, if I went over to this side... No, no, nobody... Nobody tell anyone, but my frame rate is terrible in this room. No, nobody tell anyone, but there's a little secret in here. And this is my, uh... This is where the people, right? This is where the people that dislike the videos go, right? This is not a fun place to be. I I don't see anybody alive in here, so I'm just just throwing that out there. Just don't don't forget to leave a like. <laughs> and yeah, yeah, I decided to make that cool little like area over there. Um, so that's not the only place that I've been working, right? So now. We have this new area that I can teleport to called Domination Roof, which is, this is going to be how we get inside of our house. I also released a bunch of pets because I had too many. They were annoying. I had to get rid of them. Oh, look at what we got here. We have another cockatrice. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come on, friend. Come on. Come on. Yoink. Yoink. Oh, you're strong, actually. Oh. Why, why won't he die? Why is he so strong? Why are they all level 3? And why is this... This halberd sucks, that's probably why. It's got like no enchantments. It's got lifesteal 4. Lesser sharpness 5. Um, anyways, you can barely see it because of the stupid snow, but uh... And yes, I have to light it back up, but I raised the level of all of this to cover... Minus right there. Oh, my frame rate... It's 31! I backed up the save because I'm scared of the frame rate. Um, I, I balanced out the level of the roof, right? So it's all one even surface. And what we're going to do is we're going to place like these cool little like pillars on each side, kind of like a castle. And then we're going to add like castle walls around it. And we're going to add cool designs to the outside to make this one big, like coherent kind of castle-esque base. And make it finished. I don't want to leave this base and the outside unfinished. And then here in the center, we have a little waypoint. Which, whenever we, you know, fly back in, rather than having an open entrance like this risky area I have, I have right here. Uh, we could just go up here, drop off our boy, and back inside. Cost no levels, and I can finally seal up this area since this is sketch. I also keep these guys in here because they like to try to kill my rock. And they don't do anything anyways. They're useless to me. 
one day they might die. We'll, we'll see about that. So, I also would like to add a couple of those enchantments to my rapier. So, I've got tons of XP going on now. Oh, I wouldn't say tons, but I've got a good amount of XP. And we're going to see how much this costs to upgrade my rapier again. I also have a book with advanced looting too. However, we're not going to... We're not going to do that yet, since I, I would like Advanced Looting 3. Especially since adding anything to my my weapon at this point costs me... 100 levels. Yeah, that's that's not... That's, that's not good. That's bad. Oh, it hurts. Please, don't cost 100. Cost 90? It's just, just 90? Okay. No. It's it's gonna cost a hundred, isn't it? Oh go. It hurts. Please. Okay. Vampirism two, Swifter Slash is three, Dark Shadows two. So Dark Shadows two is great. Oh my Oh my god. I can essentially just spam now. I don't even have to This is like a vanilla Minecraft sword. Let's go. Um, Winter Slash is 3. It's not 4, but it is great. Uh, Dark Shadows 2, I do more damage when it's dark. And there's no, like, debuff for it. I don't do less damage when it's light. And then Vampirism 2. Some people say it does not stack with, uh... Where is it? Some people say it does not stack with Lifesteal 4. But that is actually wrong. It does stack. They are two different mods that do two different things that do stack. So, Lifesteal is actually better than Vampirism 2. However... Having both of them is also- ooh, lag. It's also very beneficial. So let's ditch. We used every single one of those books. Oh my god. Let's ditch all that. Let's drink our delicious carrot juice, which is very cheap and easy to make. Look at this whole chest. All you need is a golden carrot, sugar, and a purified water. And I'm gonna show you guys what I found today. So, so I was getting lots of stone. I decided to teleport back to spawn. You know, actually, that might work. Back to my original house that I owned. Back in, like, long, long time ago. A couple months ago, right? And I dug this little hole right here. I dug... No. I dug down here. So I was getting lots of cobble, because I needed cobble for, you know, smelting more stone, etc. And I found something down here that's great. You all have been telling me to do a level 5 dragon for a long time now. And it's not that I haven't wanted to, it's just that... They're not easy to find. But I found one. Right down here. Oh. 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 Get out, get out of here. We don't, we don't like you spiders. Spiders are disgusting. So yeah, I, uh... Interestingly enough, it's next to a f another dragon. And I, I thought, we've done this dragon before. This was like a way earlier episode. And I thought this was just a little bit of extra, like, burnt ground. This is literally an additional... Ooh, Makami. This, this is an additional dragon's nest. Like, what? I didn't bring... I didn't bring any... I, I guess I'll... Mm, I didn't bring any battle burritos. I, sh I should be fine. We're gonna use an ice bow. Because I was like, hmm, let's test it out, and let's check for Emerald. Yeah! So we have an actual dragon! Dude, I so hope that we get... The question is, where's the actual center? Here, let's do... Let's do this. This is easier. So, interestingly enough, I also kind of thought of, uh... Real quick, two different mods that I would like to use... In the future. Maybe... I was thinking about adding one of them to this playthrough. The other one, definitely not. The other one would be used mainly for, like, my other playthroughs and then my, uh, Skyblock series. But there is a mod called Refined Storage, which essentially allows you to have, like, it's it's kind of like, like, Technic, like the old Tekkit stuff, you know? It allows you to have, like, a computer that stores all your items and you can, like, stack them. You don't have to worry about, you know, all of my, like, my storage chests that I have. Because it's, it's pretty, you know, it's time consuming. So, I might either add that to this series, or we'll just add it to different series in the future. I could even add it to Sky, like, one block Skyblock, because I don't really, 
I don't want to mod up one block sky block, but I do want it to be a faster experience rather than like sorting chests and stuff. I'd like one centralized kind of thing. Where's... Where's the dragon? What? Nah. What? There, there's no drag. Blood moon is rising. Where? There's no dragon. What? That's not right. You know how hard it is to find a level three dragon? Or level three dragon. Jeez, a level five dragon. There's a ton of chests down here. And there's just... There's just no dragon. I mean, it's a source of emeralds, but honestly... It's quicker to get emeralds other ways than this. I'm so sad! Can I get some Fs in the comments? Oh my god. Okay, well, you know what? You know what that means, right? That means that we're going to go kill a boss. So I'm going to loot these chests. Take some of the emeralds to am a hoarder. I will keep this on the map so I can come back and get the emeralds since I do. I do like me some emeralds, but we're going to kill one of the Arlcraft bosses today. To make up for this travesty. This is disgusting. This is. I'm so disappointed. I was almost like, wow, you know. I have a reason to not kill a boss because we found some level 5 dragons. Maybe I can make this an episode where I, you know, get a level 5 dragon. Or get a dragon and start feeding him. Apparently not. Because Arlcraft hates me. Look at that, 20 emeralds. You know, I I take back what I say. I, I'm gonna... Ooh, Fapulas. Fapula crystal? No? That's fine. Yeah, we'll, we'll come back here. And we'll definitely harvest all the emerald. Probably off camera since there's... There's a lot of emerald. I don't even know why I'm taking the rest of the stuff. Yes, yeah, so I definitely take back what I said about not looting the emeralds. There's there's so many emeralds here. And plus, if you have like a, uh, a tool that can like chain, right? You just do this and it will automatically clear up everything in between and you can get to all the ores. It does not break the gold since they don't have like physics. That's okay. Because we got lots of emeralds. And then we got some redstone. And we can auto smelt the iron. And yeah, there's just tons of loot here. We got 36 emeralds. So we're going to go home. And we're going to dump all this stuff. And then we're going to get set up to do a boss. I'm going to do a little bit of research. See which boss I want to do first. Um, I'm definitely, like, spoiler alert. I'm very overpowered to fight bosses. Honestly... Arlcraft is easy. At first, it's unforgiving as hell. But once you get situated, this mod pack is super easy. Um, hardcore Arlcraft is a little, little sus though. But I do want to upgrade my Arlcraft mod pack. Maybe it, I do want to start a new series soon. So we'll see. We'll see how far the series goes. But I am. Um, I would like to finish my base and kill all the bosses for sure. So we're gonna run back to the base. Oh man, look at all this. Look. Look. I literally need charred cobblestone too, because it's a block that I wanted to, you know, build with. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna AF3 this. I wanna see if there's a dragon somewhere here. It's gotta be somewhere, right? The Spectre over there. And there is a Vapula crystal. Where'd it go? Yeah, look at that, right there. The guy did drop a Vapula Crystal. Look at that. Yeah. Nice. We can make a better version of that other tool. Alright, so we're gonna we're gonna head out of here. Like I said, we're gonna go back to our house. And we're gonna set up to do good things. Alright, so this is interesting. So we need soul cubes to summon them, right? So Oh boy. Um, I used a bunch of things that I shouldn't have used. However, I do have some that I, I have an undead soul stone. I literally just got that. So, yes. Undead soul cube just needs shadow stone and that undead soul stone. 
Oh, sh no, 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 no. What is this? No Christmas events. I forgot to tell you guys. It's you're in my house. Oh, I hate that mod. Guys, I really hate that mod. All right, villagers are safe. All right, we're not taking any chances here. You absolutely get lost. Oh, man. Oh, lobbers. No. no. Okay. No lobbers. You guys make stuff into lava. I'm good. No, 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 no. I was waiting for this to happen. It didn't happen yet. I was waiting for it to happen. I knew this was going to happen. As long as we stay out of their... As long as we stay out of their range for attacking. Okay, that's... Small loss. Alright, nothing over here. Okay, it's not spawning mobs anymore. Oh boy. Alright. That's good. Nothing over here. Villagers. Roll call, roll call. You're all okay, right? Yes, okay. Alright, that's cool. I'm glad they're over there. That's fantastic. This is why you don't have a wooden house anymore. Okay? This is why we don't have a wooden house anymore. Oh, jeez, no. Gotta make sure there's no dark spots in here. I don't want stuff spawning naturally. It's bad enough stuff spawns from these events, okay? Ooh, we got a hidden spot. Okay, I think... I think we're good. At least inside we're good. Outside we're not. Anyways, those soul cubes are what summon the bosses when you build the altars. And also, it's crisp. I didn't know those were dark spots. My frame rate is 10. I'm sorry for the bad frame rate. I didn't know there were dark spots in here. No. It's so dumb. Nope. Not in here. Alright. I think we're good. Let me just double check one more. Let's turn off this. This is not helping my frame rate. Double check one more time. Make sure nothing is in here. The Aegis has actually did something this time. That's good. It's nice. These events are literally the worst. Alright, up here is a whole lot of not fun. I don't... Don't want any of you guys near my house. I should, I should definitely just close that off. Oh, jeez. My frame rate. Between winter, between recording, between this stupid event, and Arlcraft's natural lagginess. Oh, my God. Come on. Get lost. All oh, jeez. There's so many of you guys. Any other takers? I'll take your winter gifts. I really... Oh, man. I can't throw that stuff away. Stuff's pretty rare, actually. I don't have any of those charges. Wow. You, you didn't see that. Nobody saw that terrible aim, okay? Trespassers. No trespassing. This is my property. It's my domain. How dare you come into my domain and ask me to make you a sandwich, okay? What is that? Verdant Cinder level 5. You, I kind of don't want you to exist. You can, you could just stay down there, buddy, because we're just... This is bad times. We're having bad times. So we're going to go make our soul stone, soul cube thing. And I think that... Let me double check. I think that's the Amalgalic soul cube. Yeah, so you need... The Amalgalic altar consists of five obsidian pillars. Um... You need 16 obsidian, 4 diamond blocks, and an undead soul cube. I am going to study the Amalgalix. I don't remember which one that... I know which what he looks like, but I think he's the one that you need a grappling hook for. 
Dude, look at all this stuff those guys dropped. That's actually... They actually dropped me a lot of good stuff. Tundra charges, ice ball, magma. Bunch of other stuff that I don't really care about. Also, look at this, guys. So we've already got a couple stacks of the winter gifts, and I still got all these Halloween ones. Um, If I open the Halloween ones, the enemies I kill from them will drop Christmas gifts. So it's like infinite stonks. Um, and... Okay, we need... Where is it? We need shadow stone, not brick. Is everything here brick? Okay. Shadow stone is made with grass and cobblestone. So I need like a stack of cobble. And we need to go silk touch some grass? Let me... Did I save it up here somewhere? It can be made with obsidian. Wait, is that it? It has to be made with obsidian? I'm pretty sure that's not accurate. I'm pretty confident I made it. Maybe it's lush stone that's made with grass. I don't know. Either way, we only have 16 obsidian, which is exactly how much we need. Desperate times call for desperate measures. I'm going to do it. Desperate times call for desperate measures. All right. 32 obsidian. <laughs> We're going to make one set of shadow stone now we need the soul stone i literally just got this undead soul stone and it does not let you right click it the demonic ones i think actually work as you know like real soul stones they summon something i don't have one here though okay undead soul cube so we need four diamond blocks we got the emerald or sorry we got the emerald wow my brain not working brain bad small brain we got obsidian and we need four diamond blocks. Look at all look at all these resources. We're like set for life. Um so real quick, I'm gonna look up some stuff about it. I remember a while ago I watched I watched a union video about it. I just wanna be sure that I'm not gonna like screw this up and get killed. Uh I think this is the boss that you need the I think you need the grappling hook for it. Alright, so after a little bit of studying, I was right, um, Amalgalic is the worst of the bosses. I don't want to do that one first. I want to do Ravaheart, and I learned that there is a way to actually farm for the, uh, the keys, right? So, we're gonna, we're gonna put this dangerous, dangerous item away, and we're gonna go get the, we're, we're gonna save that one for last, okay? I don't want to get my butt cheeks clapped, so we're gonna need another diamond block. So we're going to make a obsidian like structure surrounding a diamond block. And then we need a soul key, which are the things that I favorited like years ago. So yeah, diamond soul key. So we need to make a soul key, which is a nether star, a soul gazer and diamonds. So I don't think I have enough diamonds. I don't know what you guys think. Um, Not in there. Whoop. Nope. It's still winter. Disgusting. May I add? Uh, we need a soul gazer and a nether star, which I did use some of them to already make some uh, more waypoints. So there's that. And I wonder, I, I wonder if all three of these soul keys are the same thing, right? Where'd they go? So I wonder emerald soul key, soul key, and diamond soul key. So soul key. And then diamond soul key. I'm a little nervous. I'm not going to lie. I'm not nervous for the first one. I'm nervous for the... For Ravahort. Oh, this is going to be a stressful episode. Alright, let's go. Let's go build it and summon it. Let's go, like... Let's go to spawn, right? So first things first. Top off. Right, we're going to top off all of our stuff. Grab a whole bunch of those. Yeah, both of those topped off. And then we're going to grab... Some gapples and some battle burritos because I am not playing games with this man. And then we're gonna go to our actual first town. And we're gonna make it their problem that we summon a boss over here. Oh, <laughs> well, there's nymphs spawning still. Like it's still you guys. Yeah. I need like a never-ending supply of those boys. Oh wait, I think this dragon. Oh, when I was flying by, I think I realized them. Um, this is the dragon. That killed me in the first episode.
my thorns just one shot that zombie and i think this dragon over here is still alive where'd he go yeah he's still alive let's kill this man so we're gonna kill this man and then we're gonna place the boss where he is Come on, my mans. Come on, my mans. That is what I thought. You are not a... You're no longer a threat to me. I have new things to be scared of. Hey, give me your flesh. Give flesh. Flesh, 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 flesh. Right? Bones of our enemies in our inventory. And we're ready to go. So we need the obsidian... And I think it's like, I don't think that's right. I, I think it's like, oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> All right. I was right. Um, it's nighttime, which is, I, I suppose fitting. So you put a diamond block in the middle and then it's a lot of obsidian. We need to steal some obsidian from one of those towers. Wait, no, not like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right obsidian like that I don't like this jump height this jump height is both a gift and a curse Dude, this uses a lot of obsidian all right we're gonna eat oh boy I'm a little nervous we're gonna eat it no we're gonna eat a battle burrito and it's go time Oh! Um. Oh my god. Okay, I need to stop pushing it farther away. You need you need to come here. Come here, my friend. It's pretty cool looking. It's actually not that strong. I I man, advance punch two sucks. Maybe, oh, ha, <laughs> creepy boy. Maybe we'll save Ravaheart for the next episode. Whoa, what is, wait, what the hell? Oh, okay, where do you, what is that? There's like a giant structure just sitting in the sky. Dude, there's one, there's one of those towers. Oh, oh my god. Wait, I don't want to kill him somewhere I- Oh look, there's also these over here. I'm so distracted. I get distracted all the time. One more shot. Boom. Alright, he died like over- Oh boy. Oh boy, trying to find the, the drop is going to be real fun. Alright, we need- we need this. Um excuse you excuse you where's my demons you know how many obsidian that cost it it fell on a tree right my my guy what what is this Dude, I don't, even, I don't even know where it went. The stupid tree mod where, like, the trees, you know, where you, like, fall through them slow. You know, we're gonna... We're gonna cut down all these trees. We go to you. This is so dumb. Where did my soul key go? I was so played! It's not right. Um, is, is he doing what I think he's doing? Is this man trying to? Bruh, that's such good. That's such good coding. I didn't know that rocks pick up creepers and drop them on you. Yeah, I I can't find my stuff though. Oh wait, I found gas tears. That's definitely from him. So he dropped some gas tears. 
Stupid rocks. Wait, wait, what is that? What is that? Hold up, hold up. I might have found it. It, it might just be from the, the smaller boys. I don't know. I'll drop that. Place that. Um, I kind of actually need those. Get rid of all this random crap. I need those as well. Get rid of you, 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 and you. Oh, wait. Yeah, Demon Soul Stone. Let's go. We got it. I was going to be so triggered if I didn't actually, you know, get it. All right, cool. So we got Demon Soul Stone. And now we can go ahead and craft that together to make a Demon Soul Cube. Which we can then use to to go to Ravaheart. But we're going to do that in the next episode. Because this, this has already been a long, long episode. Get out of here, buddies. I would like those, please. That's cool. I wonder... How do you make... We should make the other soul cubes. And we should... We should prep all the soul cubes. Well, maybe not soul cubes. But we should make the soul keys. God, this is such a nice area. This took a while. This took me like two hours to make. Because I'm a very picky person. But... Well, maybe not two hours. Give me like an hour. At least. But this is... I'm very impressed with this. I'm happy with this. My own little fancy like demon bed. Surrounded by demon cubes. Uh, speaking of demon cubes, we need some demon stone. And we are good to... I think I have to actually make more demon stone. Yeah, I'm running out of nether wart. We need to start planting some nether wart. We're going to make... Demon stone. Let me take that. And demon soul... Boom! Demon soul cube. So we now have a demon soul cube... And we have a undead soul cube. And then what are the other... There's a third boss. It is this one. The apparent soul cube. So apparent. Demon. Undead. Um, so we need a worm soul stone for that. Am, am, I, am I right there? No, we need... Wait. Aberration soul stone. We have that. Hold up. We have four of those. So wait. We literally just need Aberration Stone, which is Obsidian and Andesite. I throw away all of my Andesite. I hate Andesite. It's a vanilla Minecraft thing. I always throw it away. But yeah, we can make all three of the Soul Cubes. So we don't even need to summon the, the Emerald Soul Key, although I'm very curious what it summons. Maybe we'll do that just for, like, the the meme. Um, I do need to make a Grappling Hook as well, which... Grappling Hook, sorry. Which is a lead and an iron pickaxe. I need that for the amalgalic because he has like a he has like a attack that he like sucks you in, and it's pretty much a guaranteed kill if you get sucked in. And I don't think you can get your stuff back if that's the case. Um, I do know the bosses are pretty beefy, but I'm also very very powerful. I kind of do want advanced protection, but you know it is what it is, right? I think we'll be fine if we come in there with enough stuff. We'll definitely be fine. So in the next episode, we're going to take on Ravaheart by summon him, summoning him with a demonic soul cube. But anyways, that has been it for this episode, guys. If you do like the series, don't forget to leave a like. It really helps me out. And don't forget to leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about the series. Let me know what you want to see. And just let me know how your day was. A little heads up, I will be doing a live stream tomorrow, Thursday, at 5 p.m. EST. Uh, we will be doing Hardcore Minecraft 1.16. We're going to start a stream only hardcore series so that way I can like interact with the community more and that'd be like super cool. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe if you are new. This has been Pain Domination. I will see you all in the next video. Peace.